are so thankful for the goodness of God that we enjoy in the year 2018 when some are looking for for other places for their security in this world and in life. We are so glad we can come to you and reminded of the words of our scripture already today. There is a God in heaven. There is a God in heaven. And we pray as Daniel prayed for many centuries ago, blessed be the name of the Lord. You give us wisdom and it's with you there resides wisdom and power. Thank you this morning for the goodness that you've given to us this week and health and ability to be here in your house today and rejoicing in your good favor and how you touched one life or another here and there and given your blessings and and uh, we've been certainly enjoyed the ministry uh, you've given to us one to another we thank you that Gary and Debbie were able to be here last Sunday and well Gary's very weak and will soon go into this quarantine we just pray you're gracious power and blessing would be administered in that situation bless every day of this treatment and this stem cell immunity that uh, or procedure that's going to take away his immunity and and all of the the danger involved in that we just pray your absolute protection and safety in that need this morning in jesus name we look today for burdens that have been carried here in this congregation and praying for the Pruitt family. Ask the Lord that your gracious power would be extended to that little church today. Just lost the pastor and, and his dear wife and all of the changes that that will bring. We thank you, Lord, for your goodness and help. We pray you will look into other needs that have been mentioned time across the, the, the last few weeks. Remember that that uh, those folk in California that are in such burden and, and need and recovery. Lord, we, we just couldn't wish that on any, any of us. We pray, Lord, that you would, you would, you would exercise your power and grace. We, we know there are some that, that make some, many who know you, and we pray that you will touch them, those dear families and others that have lost everything in Jesus' name. Lord, look uh, also in in in, uh, in in Carla and Donnie's family and, and Kayla, we you know about the surgery coming up, and we pray that your hand of healing and grace would be there today in a mighty way. Prepare the way, open the way. We just ask that your your healing touch would be there, and that there would be some good results. We're ready for some good news and some good help. We pray that. Donnie, the Christmas Eve, the surgery coming up very quickly, that again, you're, you would be there and help Donnie to uh, have his heart open to all that you want to do in his physical body, and touch him spiritually as well this morning, strengthen his heart in the promises of God and in the strength and grace that only comes from heaven. We pray in Jesus' name. Lord, bless our service next week. We look forward to a, a grand time together and celebrating new life in Jesus Christ in Christmas. We just pray, Lord, that today that you will look among us and other burdens that have been carried. We thank you, Lord, for, for healing in, uh, in, in, uh, in, 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 for Gwen. We just thank you for your, your touch and ministry and extended uh, uh, to uh, need his neighbor and in Sherry's family. We're just grateful how you've been working and helping and we give you praise for what you're doing this morning. Thank you for touching Brian and working out the situation for job and all those concerns and needs we pray. And we're just grateful for the fellowship that we've enjoyed and Christmas dinner and some other things together. Lord, we remember that we're in a, in a dark day, in a dark time. Our nation, the is so polarized and vicious attacks uh, come political disarray there's economic problems there are there are problems with hatred and homelessness and and greed and exploitation and around our country for fo folk that are looking to themselves and their own comfort more than that of others and we pray oh god that you would bring some peace of christmas and new lights and new hope this year again in the fresh Lord, we come to you in Shirley's behalf this morning. We 
We know all about this need, but we're glad that you do. And we just bring it to you in Jesus' name. We thank you for her love and service and dedication to God's work for so many decades. Her life has been an example, shining example of, of joy and hopefulness in the strength and presence and sustaining power of God. Lord, we, we don't know why these things have come as they have, uh, in their weakness and legs, and, 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 and we just pray, Lord, that you would help her today in a gracious, gracious way as you command us in your word to call the elders of the church together and lay hands on, on those who are sick among you. We pray for a lift this morning for Shirley in Jesus' precious name. We ask for a healing touch. We ask for some strength. We ask, Lord, for rejuvenation of, of, of physical uh, strength, and your power, and your grace, and, and uh, that you would also do a great work of encouragement and strength in her heart as well as we depend upon you. Father, we say this morning that our faith is not in our own strength. It's not in this oil, but it's in, it's in your power and your strength. Just now we're going to not surely in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. We pray that your healing grace will flow through her and encourage and strength for the glory of God. Father, all power belongs to you. All wisdom is yours. And all might is, is yours. We, we lift up your name today. Our faith is in you for healing and grace. And we believe, Father, you're hearing our prayer today. You're on the throne. You know exactly what's taking place and what's uh, what our needs are, and we give you praise for that this morning. Thank you for your goodness. Thank you for your love. Thank you for the wonder of it all, and we give you praise for it all this morning in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord.